Yeah, this is good. Good morning, Vlogmas day number 17. Countdown bag eight. Don't talk like a baby. Like, All right, shh. Open the bag. I thought I was gonna open it. Oh, yeah, I think it's his turn. Give it to him. Give it to him. And I wanna. You know, get close together. I wanna get out with the candy. Well, you did yesterday, hon. <laughs> What's it say today? You sound it out. Sugar. Cookies. Yep. After, this is after dinner, but we'll do it after school. Why? Before dinner. Can we move? I so during the day today, Mommy will make some sugar cookies, or we'll do it after school, see what I have time for. And then you're going to decorate them. <sighs> Maybe you can do them after school. We can do them after school, let them cook, and then even if hey. after dinner. Although we got scouts tonight, so we'll, we'll manage. Some Christmas ones with what we have stocking cookie cutters. Mommy. And all different ones. Mommy. Okay? I am. Lemu! That's his name. Lemu! We had forgotten his name. Emily was right. I just rem no. She said a little bit different. She said Flamu, and that's what made me think of Lamu. Lamu, from Hawaii, the blue turtle. We have the book, and it's downstairs. Where's Peter the elf? What's he doing? What's he doing? He's teaching them. See the chalkboard? They're at school. <laughs> <laughs> They're learning from Peter the Elf. Not my. I Don't touch them. They're at school. <laughs> Do a good job, Peter. But watch Ben and Emma. Make sure they're doing good things today. Peter the Elf, let's watch the turtle, all right? All right, the other thing we gotta do. Let's go back over here. Ben, get the. Ben, get the bag of hay. One, two, three. A, B, C. One, two, three. Good job. Get the bag of hay. <laughs> All right. So we do this. We try to remember every day, but we haven't been. We've been so busy this year. Over here, we have the hidden. Oh boy, you can't see it. Um, I'll show you later on today. There's a wooden manger that my I think my father made back when I was young. And um, my mommy made a doll, baby Jesus, but he's sitting to the side. And the children need to do good deeds in order to get a piece of hay to put in Jesus' manger so that he'll have a nice bed to lay on at Christmas morning when he is born. And it helps the children to do some good things at Christmas time. Go ahead if you can. If not, just leave it. Um, so, but Emma, what did you good do yesterday? All right, put it down. This is it here. And get me the baby Jesus just to show. It's over there. Ben wanted to show you. It's over there near the bookshelf. See him? Pop him in the manger for now and we'll show him. So my mom made this. Oh, and there's a blanket. Is the blanket over there? Yeah. 
And there was a blanket that me and my brothers, oh, it's under here, um, had made back when we were kids. We got to design it and color it. And I don't even know what these are and who made what. I don't know. I forget what you made. I don't know what I, I did. I think that's the BB. Right. I don't know who made it though. Like which me or my brother. I think that's an artist. This could be the scribbles. Matt. Probably Uncle Matt. You probably can't even see it. Um, and all this good drawing is definitely my older brother Chris. And look it. Maybe Mommy, me. Look. I think I might have did this. The cross. I love you. And then he might have did this. And, and what's this. that? I don't know. Alright, so let's put... So, Emma, Jesus. hurry up! There's baby Alright, put that back. <gasps> He's breaking. It's alright, put him in that back over there. No, put it back over there. No, don't put Jesus in the bed. It's not time. I know. Alright, Emma, so what did you do? Uh, I'm gonna hurry up because it's breakfast time. I can't, I can't remember. Alright, Ben, what did you do? I did... When my lunchbox, um, Something fell, nice for someone else? When I saw a lunchbox fell, it was delicious. Mm. I picked it up, and then... Yeah? I said, this is okay. yours, and he said, no, don't go ask someone else. And I All did. right. Okay, so it's just about noontime. I've been to the market. I went back home. Well, I went to the bank first and um, brought the groceries in, put them away, and now I'm off to finish up some shopping I have to do for a bunch of their teachers and scout leaders. Um, and um, I might have to stop. I'm hoping not. I gotta look up for a sugar cookie recipe. I think I should have all the ingredients at home. I didn't um, grab that at the market, but I think I'll um, be all set. All right, so I'm gonna go over here to five below, and then I'm gonna go where's five below. I think I gotta go over here, and then I'm gonna go to Dollar Tree over here. I think five below is this way. Yes. <laughs> Alright, so I gotta go park in a different area and I'll go to Dollar Tree, which is down on the left over here. So it's in this um, parking lot. But I'll end up moving my car. So I'm doing five below and then Dollar Tree to get Ben and Emma's teachers their gifts. I'm gonna make up a basket and I will show you later. Okay, so it's just about one. I did great on time. I went to Five Below, I went to Dollar Tree, and I just grabbed um, a couple cheeseburgers and a small fry for my lunch. I'm starving. That way it won't be too late by the time I get home. I'll eat it on the way, and I'm headed home now. So I have a chance to bring all this in and get it all situated. And um, that way it won't be too late, so I'll eat my lunch on the way, because we'll probably have to have an early dinner tonight, because they have scouts, and um, yeah, that's about it. So we'll have to make our sugar cookies later, um, while I'll make them up while they're having homework time, and then they will get to frost them. If they don't get to frost them before scouts, um, they can do it. Like, I'll let Emma do so many, and then um, Ben can do some, or even Sebastian should just do some, too. We'll figure it out. Talk to you later. So, I am home. It's about 1.20. Let me show you what I got. So, I'll first start with five below. I went for a few more stocking stuffers for my daughter. And her best friend's Christmas present. We're only doing five dollars. And Girl Scouts um, gift exchange was ten or under. So I picked out a bunch of little things that she can pick for her friend and for the Girl Scout exchange. They had 
this bag, one of these like little reusable bags, Shopkins, which I don't know if I might want to put for the Girl Scout present or keep it just for us. Alright, so for my daughter's stocking, which she's obviously not going to be able to see this today, is Mr. Mr. Sketch Scented. They see these all the time on TV and they want them, and I figured I um, would get it there. It comes with eight for five dollars. So that's for her stocking. Also, for her stocking, I got these Shopkins 100 plus stickers for three dollars. I think this is going to be for her stocking. Yeah, that was for her stocking. And then also, I found these panda um, candies, uh, cookies kind of thing. Strawberry cream filled cookies. I think she'll like them because they got teddy bears. She loves anything teddy bears. And those were like $1.29. And then I found these. I've been wanting to do a pocky or pokey um, challenge. And they had only, like, two other different flavors, but, um, I don't know. I think we might just try them today and see if we like them and see what they're all about. These, again, are about the same price, $130, $140, something like that. And then, when I was looking for my daughter's stuff and all the things I needed, I saw these washi tapes. And I got to look on my receipt, which is probably in my wallet, um... I think they might have been $2, but I'm not sure. So this is like a real pretty silver, um, if you can see that pattern on it, it's really pretty. And this one is silver with the teal, really, really pretty. I don't have anything like that. And these are by Tapeworks, um, Sandy Lion. And they actually had another roll that I was going to get, if one left of the Mickey Mouse one. But I figured I'm not going to Disney anytime soon, but I don't know. I might end up doing a Mickey theme next year somewhere in my planner. But we'll see. I didn't need it. And then I got this with the candy. This was like a dollar or so. It's an icy uh, spray candy and cherry. And I think I'll give that to my daughter. Alright, so again, I'm not sure what's going to happen with this bag. Because I'd rather... I think I'm going to keep it for me and Emma. I think it's adorable. And, um, with the, um, being her friend, we're only supposed to do $5. So, this here is a lunchbox, but what it has is a, um, card game, which you can't open. Let me see. It comes with the card game, which I think she's, my daughter's getting for Christmas. So that's why I was like, I'm not going to give this to her. But um, it, I love that it has the lunch box. So if I can go back and get one, she might like that for school. I don't know. We'll see. Or for her room. It's so cute. So that's five. And then this here is five. The Big Roll Bingo. Oh, here's the receipt right here. Let's see. Yep, the Pocky is $1.29. The candy, um, icy spray candy is one twenty nine. Okay, and the washies were two dollars. And the Hello Panda strawberry is a dollar twenty nine. And then there's this as well, the Shopkins two necklaces for five dollar. Oh, these are five. I thought it was three. Um, but which is fine because she'll pick one of these for the Girl Scout and then add this with it and that'll make it 10 and it'll make one of these five for her best friend in school and um, these are cute things that <clears throat> like I think she should give this to her friend and this to Girl Scouts I don't know whichever she'd rather do and um, so that way if like she said like Harmony her best friend's not really into Shopkins but she knows all about them so these are still cute because you're like a card game and then the bingo game. So it's not like getting the actual Shopkins. So I got those. So she'll have to tell me which ones of these she wants to give to Harmony. Alright, so I went into Dollar Tree to get their two teachers, each of their teachers, their Christmas presents. And I have a couple pieces that's going to go with it. 
that's downstairs and I will show you in a minute once we go through these so and of course you, you know how it is you go to Dollar Tree and you don't just get what you went in there for so I got these two baskets the little square ones in red I was first gonna get them in green they had them in green but I said let's keep to the red theme so the plan is I already got from Dollar Tree a bag of the chocolate chip cookie mix by Nestle or somebody so I got those to add and then I got these the Betty Crocker line we got them the measuring cups the measuring spoons I grabbed up these three the pack of three little cups in red so I was trying to figure out what else to get and I didn't know I got them this double spatula which I have one it's really really good they come off so you need to clean and this small one is great for small little you know jars or whatever and this is even a medium sized one so then I got them the larger one as well from Betty Crocker hang on okay so that was my husband <clears throat> so yeah so I got <clears throat> the two different spatulas the measuring spoons the measuring cups and then I, when I first went in, I saw these, and I was like, ooh. It made me think of, like, when I make my shopping list, I wish, I was like, oh, I wish they had something Christmas with, like, shopping list, it says. So I could always add letters to it if I wanted. But I'm thinking what I'll do is I'll print up a um, recipe for maybe, like, sugar cookies, as well as, that, obviously, that bag of chocolate chip cookies, and um, just tape it on here. And that'll show them, like, you know, it's like a shopping list type of thing for them so I got those <clears throat> and then the um, the three cups all right oh and then I got these two I got two sets of these which I have myself the Christmas cookie cutters that's why I figure I'll add in a sugar cookie recipe and they'll have those. I think that'll be great. This small little thing. And then for my daughter's kindergarten teacher, I have the red bell. That will go in there as well. I have the cookie mix. And then I have a cute little plush Santa that's going to go like on top of them. So they'll see the little Santa in there as well. So I hope they'll like them. Let me um, put these in the baskets and I'll show you what else I got at Dollar Tree. All right, so I put those in there for now. I'll grab the other stuff after. I saw these, and for some reason, I've never saw them before. They're just the paper towel holder. But I'm thinking what I'm going to do is put my duct tape on them. Being I'm going to be, after Christmas, rearranging my crafts and my desk area um, of what's on my desk, um, I maybe these might go on my desk and it'll look cute with all the different duct tapes that I have. So I figured I'd grab two because I know one's not enough because they're pretty, you know, thick and wide. Um, so I thought of that. And I could always spray paint it if I wanted, but really all you're going to see is the bottom of it. So I know I needed, because I grabbed two more washi and I have a couple more that's just sitting on the top, I grabbed another butter container to store my washi in. Um, for my daughter's stocking, I grabbed this. It's the pink, which which is weird. It's got, like, mostly pink, and then it's got a little bit of yellow, um, which I don't know if that could be the colors not right. And that's why they're at Dollar Tree. Um, and they're little turtles, and we love turtles here. But that for her stocking. These are for me. I got by e.l.f. the smudge pot, which it says it's Ain't That Sweet, Long-Lasting Eyeshadow and Eyeliner. I don't know. So, the smooth gliding gel formula is perfect as a long-lasting eyeshadow or eyeliner. Enriched with the vitamin E to nourish and hydrate the delicate eye area. Dip a brush into the pot and apply along the lash line for rich eyeliner. Use a brush or your finger to apply the lids. So, it looks like it's like a light pinkish. And then I've always been seeing these at all my different Dollar Trees, but I never get it. So it's the uh, blush. And this one is in Superstar. So maybe I'll give that a whirl, see how that is. That's a nice color. I also got this for my daughter's stocking stuffer. She loves ladybugs. 
Um, I think it started from that Ladybug Girl book, I'm guessing. I don't know. And it has, like, I guess the, it's a dry erase over here on this gray. And you can stick it to a window. And that's cute with the little marker. Also, for her stocking, I got this eye mask that says Sweet Dreams. It's in a black. And the lettering looks almost lavender. So, she's been complaining of when the whole light is on, it you, she can't sleep. My son needs it on until he falls asleep. So, I've been telling her she needs an eye mask. And even though I had some, but I've been putting them aside for when we do our challenges, I wanted to get her something cute. And I was like, I saw this there. I was like, well, that'll be cute for now. I don't know if she'll wear it, how she'll do, if that'll help her. You know, she's only five and a half. So, for a dollar, it's worth a shot and try. All right. And a few more goodies in the candy. All right, oh, I got my plastic wrap that we needed. We were running out, we had no more. So I grabbed 100 square feet by the home store. It says compared to Glad cling wrap. So we needed that. I first saw these, the big bar Chelsea chew. It's so funny, it says try frozen. It is pretty good frozen, but I like it soft like this. So I figured for the three kids, they all love the Chelsea chew in the vanilla. That's a big bargain for a dollar. And then for Emma, because she didn't have as many gifts in the stocking as they do, the boys. So she loves her Sour Patch. So I got a Sour Patch Kids and Sour Patch Watermelon. She loves these. And then I was ready to check out. And there was more candy near there. And she loves nerds. So I got her these here that are grape and strawberry to add to her stocking. And that is it. Um... My mom gave me this box that she had gotten, and she got, bought a bunch of angel ornaments, all different ones. So I grabbed this one for the Benjamin CCD teacher, and I just went and I got a Dunkin' Donuts card to put in here. I think I did the $5 for her, and then I'm going to do, I'm going to see if she has another angel ornament for the Girl Scout leader. Um, I got her a $10 gift card of Dunkin' Donuts. So I'll have to figure out how to wrap those up and box those up. The CCD teacher, um, we're going to see her on Christmas Eve for that mass, and we'll give it to her. And Monday, we will have Girl Scouts. So that is it for now, all my stuff. Um, I'll have to hide all these stocking stuffers, bring them downstairs. I want to go down and finish up these teacher ones. I'm not going to wrap them up because on the countdown, <clears throat> I think it's Monday, is gather up the teacher gifts and wrap them up. So I'll do that with them Monday and I'll just leave these here in my room or downstairs till Monday. And then I have cellophane. I'll wrap them up pretty with ribbon and a bow and a tag. And my husband has to fix the bell. Um, yeah, so that'll be it. So another hour I have till the kids, I go pick up the kids. I don't have to pick up Sebastian. He has another doctor's appointment to have his shots, and we're so sick and tired of the mother picks every time, a Tuesday or Thursday. It can't be on Monday, Wednesday, Friday on her time. It has to be on Daddy's time, and it's, like, so ridiculous. Every time he says it, stop picking my day, and, you know, that's what happens. So, she'll be dropping him off at 4.30, which, again, probably means he won't get to help out with the sugar cookies, and that's why I say, you know, I pick days of the real fun stuff that he would enjoy, on the days he's here, and of course she switches it up by having a doctor's appointment on our day. We only see him Tuesday, Thursdays, and then every other weekend. So, like now, we haven't seen him since Thursday. No, I mean since Tuesday, but we didn't see him on the weekend. So, anywho, talk to you later. So I just made the cookie dough. Um... So that way when they get in, they're doing their homework, I'll start rolling it out. And they can each come up and take the cookie cutters and make a few. We'll pop them in the oven and hopefully they'll de get to decorate them. Um, even if Ben does them before he goes to bed after Scout. He's only supposed to be 6.30 to 7.30, so if he has to stay up a little bit, that won't be so bad. Um, so I'm going to be going in a little bit to pick up the kids. 
it's raining all day. It's been just misty, and now it's kind of raining. Not pouring, but pretty raining. So I'll have to get the umbrella. It's in the car. And um, I'm excited. We'll see you later. Hey, guys. It's 430. Bastion's here. We're no glasses. Ben's got no glasses on. And we've got a batch in the oven of our cookies. we got more to go, which we can put in right now on the bottom shelf. Watch out, Em. And Mommy's making dinner. Making some no. ground turkey sloppy joes. Because no. the boys have to be at Boy Scouts at 6.30 to practice for Carolyn. So we got cookies still going. And we're making our sloppy joes. Um, which just makes me think that we're going to need more bread for Daddy's sandwiches. No, Mommy's going to have to buy some more. Maybe he can go grab some tonight after Scouts. All right, so we just tried Pocky or Pokey. What do you think? Pocky. I think it's Pocky from what I've seen people say. We got the strawberry oh. one. It's octopus. They octopus. sell it shh, at um, it's Five Below. Oh. Wanted to try it, shh, and it's wicked, wicked good. I could eat this whole thing. Not right now, sweetheart. All right, clean up your monster trucks on the table. Blech. All right. So we just had our dinner, and we just are decorating our cookies. Emma did hers. Ben is doing his. He's adding the sprinkles. Not too much, okay? Sebastian needs to do his. All right, don't forget this other kind. All right. Oh, don't spill, don't spill. Okay, what color do you want? Uh, All right, so Emma's eating it. How is it? Did we make good ones? Did mommy make good ones? I made them homemade. I took the ingredients and I made them. I didn't just buy sugar cookie mix. They're supposed to be the best sugar cookies ever by Pinterest. <laughs> are you decorating? Which ones are you decorating? A snowman? A tree and a bell. Oh, you got, oh no, you got different than me. All right, don't take them all. Here. I need more, some. No, you got any. I have no, all of them. Uh, a little bit. Which one do you want? Uh, the other one. This one? Yes. You put tons. And Mommy's got angel, tree, and star. So it's 6.30. The boys went to scouts, and I'm hearing through text that, once again, we're at a new troop this year. Sebastian was in a Pawtucket troop where my brothers used to go for years. So my father doesn't want to part from them. So he's still with the Pawtucket Troop. We're at the North Providence Troop. Um, and they're not getting everything organized properly. And there's always an issue. And uh, yeah, I'll get on camera. I don't even know if I've been on camera all day. <laughs> Hi. Um, so now they're waiting for someone to come with the key, I guess. And they're not even going to get watched, and they're going to be later than 7.30, and I'm not going to get my kids home. Well, Benjamin. Um, Sebastian's mom will be here at 8 o'clock for him, so they better be here for 8. So Emma and I should probably get in our pajamas soon, and I'll probably be ending the vlog Probably before they get home. We'll see. Because I usually like 7, I like to go start editing. So, I think we might end it here. Say bye. Um, we're going to end it here. Say bye. Thanks for watching. Give it a thumbs up. And if you don't like it, stop watching. I don't like my thumbs down. People are giving me thumbs down. If you don't like vlogs, then you don't need to watch. Let's have a Merry Christmas. See you tomorrow. Enjoy the glitter.